Hello, let's discuss about the non-random mating. It is one of the driving force which results the mechanism of evolution or leads to evolution. Non-random mating means the organism mate with its same species but selection is mating. When an organism meets with peer, peer or friends, it selects uh, randomly for its mate. And there are different causes of this non-random mating and mostly non-random mating based on the similar appearance. If two individuals of opposite uh, sex are uh, very much similar in their uh, phenotype or morphology, they are likely to mate. Okay, and these uh, this leads or result to non-random mating. Okay, here I'm writing about this non-random mating. Yeah. If individuals individuals non randomly mate with their mate with their peers. The result can be a changing population, okay? Result can be a changing population. Here, there are many reasons for non-random mating. Many reasons for non-random mating okay i'm giving some example also one example here female peahens may prefer Hence, may prefer peacocks with bigger and brighter tails. Bigger and brighter tails. Okay. Uh, this is due and depend mostly on the morphology which is uh, eye catching and uh, seems to be better fit for uh, good offspring and one common form of common form of made choices is assortive mating okay assortive mating yeah this one now come to the point what is assertive mating it is an individual's pre preference assertive mating it is an individual's preference preference to mate with partners to mate with partners who are phenotypically similar to themselves okay who are phenotypically similar to themselves okay this is all about the non-random mating which leads to the evolution okay you can see otherwise you can pause the video this is one of the causing factor for evolution 
I hope you clear now. Thank you for watching. Bye.